Good morning, we're back. It's Brett Jackrell from MotoelectricVehicles.com here to review the nine passenger hard door electric shuttle. Now we got a special project from a camp up in New York to make it look, one of our vehicles look like a school bus. And here's the result. You can see we did the custom edition up there with the red and yellow uh, lights, just like a school bus would have. It's labeled Camp Bus, and you can see the quality of workmanship from our shop at Moto Electric Vehicles. So we thought this would be a great review to do the nine passenger hard door shuttle, but show you how we can modify the standard unit to make it your own. So once again, my name's Brett Jackerel. I'm from Moto Electric Vehicles. We're gonna review the nine passenger hard door shuttle from Moto Electric. Let's get right to it. All right, so what do you get with the electric shuttle, the nine passenger hard door? First, first of all, the reason why most people get this model is for the hard door kit. So we have all aluminum doors here. They won't rust on you. They're super lightweight. Anyone can open them, even a kid. You know, this one's going to a camp and then all of them are lockable. So those are really cool. And you can find those doors on our nine passenger, our 15 passenger shuttles and some of our other lower models like the four passenger shuttle, same door kit. All the doors have sliding windows. These are really cool because it lets a lot of air in the vehicle. If you're up in the north, obviously you want something you can use year round, but you also want to use it in the summertime. So that's really important. This customer got a lot of features that I do recommend some of the hard door shuttle customers to get, so we'll go over that in the, the next segment. Uh, but once again, this is the nine passenger hard door shuttle. It's gonna get 40 to 50 miles on a charge. This customer especially requested it to go five miles an hour, so they're gonna get much more, probably into the hundreds, uh, but usually going 20 to 25 miles an hour, you're gonna get about 40 to 50 miles per charge. Once again, I want to review like we do in all our videos. We use Trojan American-made batteries. We use Curtis controllers, which are programmable and American-made. Programmable is super important because you can plug in, see if there's anything wrong with the vehicle, adjust the parameters like we did with the speed, so that's super important. And then the last super uh, component that we do that no one else does, we give you a Pro Eagle onboard charger, which comes with a three-year warranty, so that's really cool as well. Uh, in this vehicle, it does have the rugged tire. These do come with DOT tires as a standard model, but you can see this customer is going to be in a lot of mud. Uh, so they do have a rugged tire on here, and then they also got the running board kit. So once again, you see a beautiful shot of the nine passenger hard door shuttle from the side view. Let's take it to the back and review a lot of the batteries and the chargers and what's back there. All right, guys, so we're at the back of the nine passenger hard door shuttle, and, and this is one of the major reasons why people go with this model, and it's the back of the vehicle other than the hard doors. So you'll see it has the aluminum door in the back, very easy to open. We went over that in the previous segment. But the really cool thing is this has all this open space where you could put luggage back there, tools, your belongings, whatever you want. All this is open space, and it has a deck that you can sit things on. Okay, so underneath here, you also have space. You can put your belongings there, jackets, whatever you want. So this has a lot of storage compared to some of the other electric shuttles because it only has three rows. So if I close this aluminum door, you're gonna see that the charger outlet's actually on the back of the vehicle. So that's a, you know, once again, these all plug into one 10 volt, 20 amp outlets. The same outlets that's in your garage is the same outlets these charge off of. So it's not like a Nissan Leaf or any of the higher compact cars standard 110 volt outlet. Now, this customer is going to get much more range, but that's really important that the charger's on board. So when you go from point A to point B, you can plug in if you need a little bit more extra than, you know, 40 to 50 miles that it gets standard, then that's going to be important for you, the charger's on board. And that's a feature not everybody gives you. You'll see you have your four-way flashers the back here. You have your tail lights, your blinkers, you have your uh, running lights, you have a reverse light. So everything is back here as far as safety to meet DOT regulations, but remember these are not street legal due to the weight. So you have to get an exemption if you want a VIN number and make this street legal. These are meant for like parking lots, camps, anything with private property. And you'll see all this has AS1 certified glass all the way around including the front. All the sliding windows are also AS1 tempered glass, so uh, a really well built vehicle and they actually have all the features you want on there to keep the people safe. These are kids, they have seat belts in them, and uh, you know you also want your pastors, whether you're in a hospital or church environment, to be safe. Now this customer has a lot of features inside that I want to show you that don't come standard, but I do suggest it, like I said in the previous segment. They have DVD monitors, which is obviously a luxury item, but they have air blowers, fans, heaters, everything to make their climate, and this vehicle adjust to the New York climate. And I want you guys to see that. So with no further ado, let's get in the vehicle and let's show you what our guys in the shop can do. All right, so the first thing we want to go over, we're going to go over the interior of the unit, but this one has a DVD monitor. Since it's the hardest to pick up on the camera, we're going to do it first. 
But we're going to go ahead and pan over there. I'm going to turn up the volume. He's going to get extra close. But let's uh, show him what this entails. Now, right now, you'll see the DVD monitors on, and we have it going through the vehicle, which is really cool. So you have two settings. You're always going to have your PA system with the vehicle. You're always going to have your radio, but we actually tie in the DVD monitor to the radio. So all you have to do is preset one, and you're right to the DVD monitor. If you have an announcement, bring it right back, and you can turn on the PA system. You're good to go. So that's really cool. So let's wrap around. Let's come around this way. Adam, let's show, ahead. Let's show them what we got in the dash here. If you want to just zoom in on that heater. This is a 48 volt heater, really cool. They actually do a very good job. Let me turn it on so they can see it in action. Okay, and we'll turn this off. Okay, you'll see it has a three element option. It also has a two element option. So you can actually control how much heat's coming out of here. But when you're in the winter time, that's actually a really cool thing to have. Okay, you also, also have stereo and PA system. That comes standard. Okay, something that this customer wanted because they're dealing with kids. They're in the camp environment. They wanted to have something a little bit special for them. So you'll see they actually have sirens and animal noises. So this is a cat. Then you got the rooster. Then you also got some sirens too. So yeah, a little bit maybe something that's not for everybody, but when you're trying to customize a vehicle to make it special for a bunch of kids that are coming to your camp, it's a great example how we can kind of retrofit our shuttles, and that's what we're trying to show you. Wood grain steering wheel comes standard on all of our shuttles. You got your blinker bars and your headlights right here on the left side, your four-way flashers. You can see we put in the custom switches for the DVD player. We also have one over here for the bus lights that you guys saw in the very beginning, okay? You got easy forward and reverse with backup alarm, okay? You got full control of the fans in here, which is an addition. So all cool stuff, you got a horn on here, okay? All cool stuff that comes on this vehicle that normal manufacturers and normal just regular golf carts don't have. So let's open up the doors. Let's show them around here, Adam, if you want to come around. Okay, remember that all of our electric shuttles are produced here right in Atlantic Beach, Florida. So everything that you have, batteries, controllers, charge, everything is put in here in America and we give you one of the largest warranties in the nation. I'm gonna flip open this seat, okay? Let's show them the battery packs. Remember, you have four total in the back and then you have eight underneath the second row. These are all Trojan T105 batteries. If you guys want a little bit bigger of a battery, if you have to go further, we have them. But this is the standard battery that comes with all the shuttles. And the really cool thing that I like what they do in the shop is if you guys get an accessory like a heater or an air blower, they actually label all the wires. So if you do have a problem down the road, if a fuse blows, at least you know what it goes to. Okay, and that's really important when you're dealing with electronics, okay? We'll go back here, okay? We'll lift open this seat and you'll see there's nothing there. You got all your electronics, a plate underneath there, and you can see, zoom in on the seat belts. If you guys want seat belts, it's not a standard option, but you can get them. These guys are in the camp setting. A lot of people on you know, VA facilities or you know, uh, people that are gonna actually take these on the street that get an exemption uh, do need to have seat belts, so we can install those as well. So to wrap up this video, guys, once again, this is the nine passenger hard door shuttle. It's all automatic. You don't have to deal with a stick shift. It's just a forward and reverse switch. All major American-made components. We're based right here in Atlantic Beach, Florida. We'd love to do your next electric shuttle project, especially if you're up north. We ship all over the world, even overseas. So give us a call at 904-247-1818 or visit us online at motoelectricvehicles.com and see our full lineup, over 50 vehicles that you guys can choose from, uh, choose from, and I bet you we can fit you into one. So give us a call when you guys have a second. Thanks, guys, for joining us.